Hey, y'all, it's Big Fat Reverend Bird here again. And I'm here today to talk about friends. Being the character that I am, and I am a character, I've got some pretty fucked up friends in real life. I'm not gonna lie. Let's start off with my friend. We'll call him Jersey Shore because he's Italian. This guy's been drinking since he was six years old on a big wheel. Hey, man, it's, a, it's okay. It's okay, man. I'm, I'm good to drive. I just need a juice box and some crackers, man. He's the kind of guy that when he gets drunk, he thinks every chick wants him. You know, typical Guido, pretty much. Hey, baby, I'm fucking sexy. Come over and suck my dick. Like, like he thinks every chick in the world is going to come to him and suck his dick without saying anything. Like, just walk up to him and suck his dick and... You know, be done with it. So he let slip to me one time that during sex with a girl, he literally stopped, checked his watch to see what time One Tree Hill was coming on, and then resumed because it was only 10 minutes to 8 and Jersey Shore wasn't on yet. In his defense, this is the guy that fixes my car and reinforces it with steel so I can drive it. So moving on to my next friend. Let's call him the other Italian. He's like an elephant that never forgets. Oh, oh, burn, you broke my window. Oh, you sat on my glass table and broke it. You burned my house down. You killed my dog. Dude, that was two weeks ago. When the fuck are you going to shut up about it? But in his defense, I have broken a shitload of his lawn chairs. Just saying. And then, lastly, comes my cousin. We'll call him Wannabe P. Diddy. He's one of those guys who acts like a douchebag, dresses up like he thinks he's P. Diddy, you know, pink polo shirts, you know, really gay white shorts, but he's not gay at all, according to him. He smokes cigars like they're weed. He drinks scotch on the rocks. Well, oh, did I say scotch? I meant wine coolers. Sorry. So sorry there, uh, Mr. P. Diddy. And also, he's been on TV a couple times. Which makes him think he's more awesome than anybody else. I really can't say anything in his defense because uh, he's still hiding in the closet from me. I can't find him amongst all the pink polo shirts and, and the lisp and his uh, gay Hollywood friends. But uh, he gave me an intro to use to my video from some unknown dude. I don't know who the hell this guy is. Supposedly he was on some soap operas or The Sopranos or some shit. I don't know. So, uh... I'll give it a try. I'll let y'all see it and tell me what the hell you think. And, uh, yeah, enjoy this bullshit. Roll the tape. Yo, what's good, people? This is your boy, Matt You. And when I'm not recording in the studio, and when I'm not on tour, I'm tuning in to your boy, Reverend Burns Show. So stay tuned and watch Reverend Burns on YouTube.com slash Reverend Burns. You know, peace.